everybody welcome back to my channel for those who are new to my channel i am key and this is keys playing life so really really quick yeah i have had to film this video twice because i have an overactive pu puppy that rules my life so really quick I'm trying to catch my breath this is a requested video um i have a few requested videos that i'm trying to do but this video will actually have to be a part one part two simply because i have a sort of big collection and it's a lot <laughs> so i will have to break it down in two parts but i will try to make these videos as fast as possible so somebody wanted to see my perfume collection so i decided to share that with you guys but also with a twist i'm going to give you the notes that's in each perfume the price that i pay for it plus the ounces so the first one we have is chloe nomad this perfume It's freaking amazing. It smells so good. It's a very, um, very, very beautiful scent. I don't, there's no other way to describe this scent. It's absolutely positively beautiful. When you wear it, people, if they, if they are familiar with Chloe, um, they know you're what you're wearing. And, um, it has a wood fragrance with flesh floral notes, mineral oak moss with the sweetness of Marabella plum and freesia. This is a 1.7 ounce and it was $84 and 75 cents. This, both of these were a gift from hubby actually. Um, one was a birthday gift. One was an anniversary gift, but both of them were gifts from hubby. Something's pulling. Hold on one second. My hair. So, um, but both these are, this one is a 1.7 ounce as well. And this is your regular Chloe. I don't believe you can see that without the light getting a hold to it. Um, this has a top, uh, the top note is the pink peony, the freesia. Um, I think this is lychee, a middle, the middle note is mango. Oh no, I'm lying. The middle note is magnolia flower lily of the valley and rose the base is cedar wood amber and honey when i tell you you need this you need this everywhere i go when i wear this they tell me how good i smell and they ain't lying because i smell good hold on guys i think he's thirsty okay moving on we're gonna go to jimmy choo Oh, I just dropped my Clinique Happy. One second, guys. It's time for me to get rid of those flowers. I've had them for about a month. I just hate to depart from flowers. But Jimmy Choo Flash, um, this was a gift. I had seen it. I wanted to see if you could see it. Like, really see it there. I had seen it. I wanted it. Um, just because I have another Jimmy Choo that I will be showing you guys. This one, it was okay for me. It doesn't have staying power. I, I feel like um, the scent doesn't last as long on the body. Um, but the top note is strawberry, pink pepper, tangerine. The middle note is tuberose, jasmine, and lily. The base is Helotrope and Blonde Woods. It's 1.7 ounces, which is crazy because this looks different. For this to be, no, this is a 3.3 ounce. But a 1.7 ounce can cost you $48.74. I was going to say, that is definitely not a, a, a 1.7 ounce. Jimmy Choo. Y'all, this smells so good. I actually have two of them because that's how good they smell um this scent is very hard to find so when you do find it you better hold on to it but this is bay honey i love this scent it smells so good it smells so grown um not not this works for all ages. Let me just say that. It works for all ages. And I just think this is one of those scents. If you find it, you need to get a backup just in case they decide to discontinue it. Because that's how good it smells. Now, this, at first you can find this in like the uh, department stores. But now you can find this in Marshalls and Ross. And 
this is a is this this is a 1.7 ounce and it can cost you $48.74. Okay, so moving on, we're gonna go with my Carolina, Carolina Herrera. Good girl. My mom turned me on to this thing. She stole my other one because I had a limited edition one. It was a bigger, bigger high heel. She stole it. So all I have is this one. And this is, does it say how many ounces? No, it doesn't say on the shoe. But this was $96 uh, dollars and it's 1.7 ounces. Um, it has flirty, um, I mean, fruity almond, um, floral tuberose, jasmine, sambe, um, oriental, um, tonka bean, and cocoa. This smells... <laughs> this is what you need in a boy room. If you're going in a boy room, you need this. You need this press spray this on your bodies so you can just take over the world because this smells so freaking good. And let's not mention that the shoe is absolutely beautiful. The next one I have is the Carolina Herrera, Herrera 212 Sexy. I love this because it is many ounces 3.4 ounces and it opens up on both sides so that is what i love about this and i think the packaging on this can you see it i want to turn this light down the packaging on this was really really pretty there we go there we go really really pretty and i just really love that smell now, I will say it doesn't last as long, but it smells really, really good. And this is $106, and it has tangerine, Vermont, cotton candy, vanilla musk. So, the next one I'm going to show you is my CK Shock. This is okay for me. Um, I got this because you'll see in probably the next video, if not this one. But I got it because I love the Calvin Klein CK1. Everywhere I go, people love that scent. I wanted to try this just to give it a try. This is what I typically spray on me for work because it's one of those, like, I won't be buying it again, but it doesn't smell bad. It smells good, but it doesn't last. It doesn't last as long as the others last, and I just don't like that. But this uh, was $40, and it has clementine, purple lavender, cucumber, ashmethis, black pepper, black basil and chocolate and cedar cedar mom or something like that so yeah this is just what well, this did not do the job for me this was just okay um let's see oh it also has tobacco amarine uh cash mean musk and patchouli you can smell the patchouli in there actually too um another favorite as you can see which is so good i had to buy a bigger size um this is bay you need it in your life if you don't already have it in your life you need this in your life um the smaller one ranges for 82 the other one i spent like i think a hundred 140 for the bigger one um but it has white pepper, orange blossom, grapefruit blossom, salted vanilla, cedar wood, and white amber. Guys, go cop this. If you, this Olympi by, I think this is by Paco Rabanne. Let me make sure. I think that's who it's by. I don't see it on here. If you don't have this though, please. Please, please, please go get this. This right here is a bomb scent. This, I got two. I got two. Because that's how, I got two. Okay. Because that's just how bomb that is. Um, The next one I'm going to show you is Daisy. Is it this one though? Yep. This was a gift. 
for my birthday from my cousin. And it's Daisy by Marc Jacobs. First of all, the packaging is so girly. It's so pretty. Um, <laughs> I'm absolutely in love with the packaging alone. But this is, this right here, the smaller one retails for $60. I think this one, the bigger one is like a hundred and something dollars. I'm not sure. I know it's like a hundred and something. I just don't know where it stops at the hundred. Um, but it has ruby red grapefruit, grapefruit, raspberry green leaves, and pear, uh, wild rose, violet, apple blossom, lychee, jasmine petals, musk, plum, and cedarwood. And that is what it looks like. I just want y'all to get that and see that and understand that this is bae. This, <laughs> this is, this, it smells so freaking good. And the next one we're going to go to is his, her cousin. Because you know, your cousin needs a cousin. Um, this is Daisy Dream. This, hold on, because I want y'all to be able to see that packaging. This is um a really soft scent. It's very soft it's um powdery soft you smell like you just got out the shower it smells really good um this one was 106 dollars no i lie because i got the bigger one so it was probably more than 106 dollars not sure but i know it can range it can get up to 106 and plus um it has blue wisteria jasmine blackberry coconut water um, this right here is 3.4 fluid ounces. So I did get the bigger one just because Marc Jacobs does their thing anytime and their perfumes are always bomb. So not all of them, but the ones I've encountered so far, um, are really, really good. I think there's only one that I did not like that did not smell good. And I can't think of the name of it, but this, this is bad this i don't know why i didn't i thought i wrote this down why don't i have this on here i don't know why i don't have this on here i didn't write this down but this is um i'll put what what the notes are right here somewhere but this is michael kors sexy ruby I actually paid um, $123 for this, and it smells so freaking good. The bottle is so sexy. This is one of those grown boardroom, boardroom type of scents you want to have in your arsenal. I just think it's a really sexy, it is what it is. It's a really sexy scent. Um, it makes me feel like... A woman like when I put it on I'll sometimes even spray this at night just because it smells so good so when I get in the bed with my husband he can smell it this smells so really good it's a very very sexy sexy scent um so yeah that is part one of this video guys um we'll get to the other side which is a little more a little more expensive um We'll get to that side in the next video. But I just wanted to come share this side with you guys and kick this video off. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. I hope you got what you wanted from this video. Definitely go check out some of these scents. And let me know. Let me know if you have some of these um, perfumes already. Because um, I know a lot of my YouTubers, I was inspired to grab some of these perfumes by you ladies so let me know if you have a few of these already and like i said we'll do part two part two will be right behind this video but i'll definitely put part two out for you guys so i'm about to get out of here remember to think smart and spend smarter and i will see you guys in the next one bye